What is up guys, welcome back to the channel. If you're new here, definitely hit that subscribe button down below as well as give this video a thumbs up if you happen to enjoy it. Okay, also if you're new here, um, you wouldn't know I already dropped the video today. So yes, you guys are gonna get to begin two videos today. Be super excited, I'm excited about it. Nah, I'm actually I'm super tired. <laughs> but um, what we're doing today is our usually weekly thing. We're looking at the full drop list for Supreme. Um, it came out like last night, but I could have did it last night, but I was so tired, so I'm gonna do it right now. And I mean, I've seen a couple pieces I like, but we're gonna like take a full look and see what we really do like and what we don't like. Cause I kind of have like mixed feelings about this week. It's like any week is trash and there's some good stuff. So you gotta just like sift through the, you know, sift through the trash, you find your roses, whatever. Anyways, let's get into it. Okay, so here we are on the website right now. We're looking at the, you know, as usual, we start from the bottom, we're going up the top. We're looking at the Salome Pants, um, or Salome, or however you want to call it, which was like a German artist. Well, I think it's the German artist. I'm not too sure, so I'm not going to go too in depth. I'm not really going to talk about anything else about the guy. I'm just going to say he's a German artist. That's it. Um, I'm not a really big fan of this. I kind of like the blue colorway though, but I'm not, I don't like the like design on it. I'm not, so I won't be copying this at all. But I think it's pretty, I think it's a pretty dope piece, but I'm just not really into it. But I think it's pretty dope. Um, you know, you have the Supreme on the chest area on the chest. You have the Supreme on the chest area on the top left. Uh, if you can make, I don't know if you can really make it out that too well in the shirt. So I'm not really a fan of it. Like I said, but I do like this blue colorway. I, I, and I think it's kind of dope, but I'm just not a fan of it. I, I understand what they're trying to do with designs. I think it's, it's, di it's cool to be different sometimes. So this is like a different piece, and I, I, I like it for that. But I'm just not into it like that. So next up we have the Rose Accord beanie. Um. Don't like this at all. You cannot. You can barely make. You can't really make out the Supreme branding at all on this beanie. Um, I mean, it'll be fun to give to. Except for this white one. I guess you kind of can make out. I don't know. It'd be it'd be fun to give to a girl for a present. I guess. I don't know. Other than that, I would never wear this. Even though I love beanies, this this one ain't it. This just one ain't it. So moving on. Velvet cap. Um, you guys know I hate the Supreme hats. I mean, they have some dope hats sometimes, but they don't fit my head. And this is one of the ones that are retarded on me. So definitely hate it. Oh, let me go back and downvote these other ones as well because I totally forgot. Got you know, got put my votes in. Got to get my voice out there. Okay, now this one is the shadow plaid flannel shirt. And if you know me, I love flannel shirts. And I'm sorry to say this, even though this has a lot of downvotes and a lot of people hating on it, I absolutely love this shirt. I I think I love all three colorways: the middle the most, the front the second most and then the back the last because it's just kind of plain but the middle to me is hella dope and I might want to cop that because I think it's pretty crazy and judge me judge me not I don't care uh, I like the flannel shirt okay beanie I ready to give a thumbs up because absolutely I love this beanie I don't man I love this beanie I like it. it's new era and new, new era makes quality beanies and so most likely the green you can't really make out the Supreme too well on a lot of the colors. On the green, you can see it predominantly, and on the gray, so I'm kind of liking the gray colorway, or maybe the green. Next up, we have the Menace Hooded Sweatshirt, um, which is really I'm not a fan of at all. There's really just nothing special about it. It has albums going down each arm sleeve, and it has like real no, no real branding on it at all. So basically, I can't really tell what the albums say, but yeah, I can't really tell what they say, but I know it says nothing about Supreme, so. Moving on from this piece. Okay, so I already went over this piece in um, in my North Face review yesterday, and I definitely don't like it. I think it's a waste. The price tag is insanely high, and it's just, if I wanted a North Face hat, I would go buy a North Face hat. I don't care if it's leather, like it's not worth the price right now. Okay, so the S logo sweatpants, I kind of like them. Like the blue colors, I think it's pretty dope. Um, what I, I upvoted it because I like them. I'm not going to buy it though because I'm not a fan of these sweats like that. But I like the design and I like they drop them all the time. If it was like something they don't drop all the time, then yeah, I would cop. But they drop these like almost almost every season. So that's a definitely a no for me on this. But yeah. Okay, so I upvoted the Supreme Playboy Pocket Tee because um, I think it's kind of dope. It has like... Um, on the sleeve, it says Supreme. I think that's embroidered, and I think that on the chest area is embroidered as well. Um, it has a couple, it has what comes in six colorways. I think the green is, and, the, and the blue are pretty dope. I can't really see what the, I don't know if, the, oh, let me check. Yeah, so the bunny changes on different shirts. Like on the on the blue shirt, it's white, and then on the orange shirt, it's black. I don't know what's gonna change on the, on the black. Black is most likely gonna be white too. 
but um, yeah, it's a pretty dope shirt. Um, will I cap it? Don't know because it's mad. It's premium price, and I really like playing. It's, to me, the shirt is too like basic for a premium price for me, so I won't be buying it. But I like it. I'm just not gonna buy it because it's too basic. Okay, so next up we have the S logo hooded sweatshirt, which basically they drop almost every season. Same with same thing as the sweatpants. I said this green colorway is kind of dope though. It's like it has this like Gucci vibe to it, so I'm pretty sure that's gonna sell out by people. But um, yeah, as far as the S logo goes, it's usually the same thing all the time, so I can't justify spending like 158 on this hoodie. So I'm gonna have to pass on it. But it is a dope hoodie. I just don't want to spend something that they drop every season, you know. The same, like the same thing, just different colors. Okay, so we have the Supreme New York reversible puffy jacket. And for all you people are from New York, you know, it, it got like cold overnight. So if you want a jacket, here you go. Um, basically, this jacket, it's reversible. It comes in two colors. It comes in a white and it comes in a black. And the black, what? Black has kind of like a Gucci vibe again to it. And then it has the white. The white, to me, looks hella clean. Um, but you know what? It's gonna get hella dirty fast, so not even worth it. Was it 348? Yeah, not worth the price tag for the white. The black to me looks kind of basic. It's like really, it's not really anything special about the black, so I wouldn't spend 348 on this jacket either. But it's a dope piece. I just want to spend it on it, so I want to spend this much. If it's like maybe like a hundred less, then yeah. But for 348, you can buy. It. You can get a better jacket for 348. You can better. You can get a better Supreme jacket for 348. Okay, so next up we have the Supreme North Face Leather Mountain Waist Bag, which I think is a dope piece. Thumbs up. Like, the price, oh, the price tag is 198 I think it's going to be 180 or 198 The price tag on it is insane, um, but it's also, you pay for that, the, you pay for the collab, you pay for the leather, and the piece is fire. I'm definitely might be going for this red, 100% the red, because the red's amazing, so hopefully I cap that. Okay, next up we have the Nouveau, I probably butchered that, but I'm going to say Nouveau Basic, um, Nouveau Logo Tee, all kinds, slub jersey. Um, I'm pretty sure this is embroidered and it's a premium, so you're going to get the premium price tag, which is $78. Okay, I can tell, it looks like it's embroidered by like the stitching on the cross kind of, so I'm 100% like it might be embroidered. And then you have different colors, I'm, I thought the, like, the letters might change on the different shirts, but on the black it looks the same, and on the white it looks kind of the same so basically the same so I don't know if like different colors you're gonna get like different um, style of letters but yeah it comes in like seven colorways to me the black is the most fire I mean I can't really see what the red or the like the pink looks like yet but the black is 100% fire and I'm I'm gonna cop this for a premium price tag this is a T I would cop for the premium price okay so next up we have the Supreme North Face leather mountain parka which I went over this yesterday as well. The price tag is estimated 1098 but I'm pretty sure it was like 900 for this. I don't know. I'm pretty sure I saw it yesterday for 900 The prices haven't been dropped yet. I don't think so. So it can, it could, it might be a thousand, but I'm pretty sure it's 900. Um, like this is another fire piece. I am definitely going for it in the red colorway. But the red colorway to me, like I said, is insane. And I gotta have it in the red. So definitely give it a thumbs up. I already did, but I'm gonna give it like another like five. I don't know if that even counts, but that's how much I want this. Okay, so next up we have the inflatable chair. This, I'm going to give a thumbs up, but I'm hoping that the price they have it estimated at is not what it's going to be listed at. Um, this is definitely a hype piece for this week. I am definitely liking the Claire colorway, but I might sell, I'm Claire, Claire colorway is a dope piece. It's a um, removable seat cushion. I guess it has a seat cushion you can remove. I can't really tell by the picture, but yeah, it's inflatable. It's an armchair, dope piece add to your collection and just hoping the price tag is not that high because I don't think this is worth 238 <laughs> okay okay so lastly we have the Supreme North Face leather shoulder bag and okay if this is the estimated 118 that's not a bad price because I thought it was gonna be like a lot higher but 118 estimation for this is not bad I would 100% cop at that price and I mean, obviously like I said I would be going for red colorway in all of them I see every piece I'm gonna go for that red leather quality colorway and 118 is not bad like I said so if you want it definitely go cop it because 118 you could you could do worse you could do a lot worse 
I'm surprised they went that cheap. If it is going to be really 118. So that's pretty much it for the full drop list. There are a couple of hitters in there, and that's what I'm going to be aiming for. That t-shirt, that Novo, Nuvo, whatever you want to say, t-shirt, definitely going to cop. Even though it's premium, and I don't really like that premium price tag. But the t-shirt looks dope. I'm going to cop that. Um, the chair, the North Face pieces, and there's a couple other things, but you know, you see when pick up, you see on pickup day what I grab and what I don't grab, or if I even get a spot, because I'm pretty sure the text was supposed to come in like 20 minutes ago and I didn't get a text yet, so you boy might be going online doing a live cop. <laughs> so, but yeah, so hopefully you guys enjoyed this video. If you did, definitely give it a thumbs up and make sure you hit that subscribe button. Make sure you enter that giveaway. I think it ends in like a day or two. The link will be at the top of the description. The spring giveaway for the t-shirt i forgot what the t i don't even know what the t-shirt's at it was like right here it's disappeared but i will find it for you guys i promise don't worry about that so let them haters keep you down stay positive it's easy to hate hard to love peace